Hello. I banged my cup on the counter. I don't know what to call it. Daily challenge. It's dance before us. I'm a little foggy. I don't know. I woke up earlier than I normally do. And I also had to drive. Eh. Almost two hours. I am post shot number one for my uh, COVID vaccination or whatever it's called. Um, yeah, so I'm 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 more tired than I am anything else. As exciting as it is, from I see the flag. Being in a car for that while kind of just saps your energy. I mean, I enjoy <clears throat> driving and the act of driving, especially the route that I took to get to the location. It was very pretty, but I'm tired. <laughs> and what better energy to have right before recording a video of GeoGuessr Daily Challenge? Let me tell you. Oh, yeah, originally my first shot was actually, my previous schedule was actually for today as well, and it was just as long of a drive to the other location, but since it was a Johnson & Johnson one, I scheduled it before they made the announcement, and the um governor of my state decided to put a pause on all the Johnson & Johnson ones, so I had to reschedule. Uh, I looked around, thankfully I was able to find one for the exact same date, it was just in a different part of the state, and I figured, eh, you know, why not, uh, I've got my second one already scheduled, it's at the same location, so I have another drive ahead of me for it, Jetang, I'm going to see if I can't find Jetang, but, Nusum, uh, Jitang or Nusu Uma. But that's what I've I've literally gotten the in the door back to my apartment probably five minutes ago. Um Yeah. Going to relax the rest of the day. I've got groceries I have to buy for the baking thing, cooking thing. I don't know exactly what it is just yet. For next week's video. Probably either do that today or maybe tomorrow. Maybe I'll enjoy the rest of my day off. Uh, but things have to be done. Geoguessers have to be guessed and recorded. Uh, looking around, I don't think I'm ever actually going to find this place. It's, I think it's a small enough location that you know, having to go around all this entire country, it's, it'll be hard to locate it, but, you know, I'll try as best I can. I wasn't that far off, though. Were any of these, it was East Java. Okay, it wasn't any of the things I was looking at. I think that was, I mean, it was a shot. I will 100% take that. Pravna? Uh, I don't know where Pravna is. Pravna. Um, excuse me. Uh, let's see. Yeah. So if it's, it's a little bit like subdued than normal, maybe that's, that's, that's my reason for doing it is I'm probably a little tired. But I will try not to have that distract any more than it already has. It's uh middle of the week. I've got not much else to look forward to for like the things I need to get done this week. I've gotten back to probably I'd say after being in the car for that long, I was ninety percent yesterday as far as my back being fully healed. It was like ninety percent yesterday. Now it's not so much just from sitting in a car that long, so I think that's kind of skewed a little bit, but somewhat back to normal. All of the 
uh, steroid pills you take for when you do that type of injury to yourself. Uh, those not aware, um, I think it was called like methylprednisolone, and it's a steroid which, if I remember correctly, will increase blood flow. Like I think they dilate your veins, so more blood flows, more blood flows to the location where you're hurt. It it helps it heal faster. Uh, compared to not taking this, if I were to try to normally heal, I would probably be out for three, maybe four weeks of just agony. But thankfully, medication I get for when it happens, and thankfully it does not happen all that often, cuts it down to less than a week. And... That week has passed. M18. All right, so we've got ourselves a road, which makes me think. It's the M4. We're, we're out here, I think. Although, that's Kazakhstan. Are you going to... R's and P's. Moscow one's an M1 or an M2, isn't it? It's M9, M7. M18 makes me think we are like here, maybe. It's a big enough thoroughfare to be labeled as an M. Why aren't you giving me a name for this road? That annoys me. Come on. Where's some more? Oh, I ran a... Oh, Jesus Christ. We were... Murmansk. We were out there. It's the E105 and apparently something else. I'm fine with that score. That one's hard to find. Oh, we've got ourselves another. Um, Belarus. I don't think that's Belarus. I'm going to be hungry. Yeah, that's Hungary. So we're here. Although it's all in Cyrillic. None of this is in Cyrillic. Belarusian flag is not this flag. Now I am confused. Let's see. Looking to see if there's a sign to let me know where we are, and there is not, unless this seems to be an embassy. I don't think it is. Um... Oh, it's the colors there, man. This 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 annoys me. I know. Like everything's here saying, no, it's you you were right, but this flag is just like not cooperating with what I think this location is. I can't go down there. I want to. It won't let me. Maybe it will now. There we go. That's what I needed. Is this like an embassy? Why am I back here? Now we got French. How much time do I have? I have half my time left. European Parliament. Green Bites, eat well. Is there? I don't see a URL. I don't know if I'm going to get this. I mean, I'm, I feel very much like I should just plink this in Belarus. It's not Belarus. It's... Uh, no, that flag would be... All right, Estonia, it's, it's not. It's one of these. I don't think it's Latvia. Not the Lithuanian flag. I'll say we're, in, we're here. It's probably not. I'm okay with that. Um, these errors always happen. It's always around these locations. Oh, we went flying by. I wanted to see what that one said. Um, Freedom of security. What do we got? I can't read that. Hmm. Can I get over here? I can. Um. Two Borg. Good beer. I like Two Borg. Let's see. That doesn't help me. No, that stuff does. I'm getting a lot of businesses, but the only problem is it's signs that are too far away or would not be sh 
showing a URL that's a bank. Yeah, we're Bulgaria. God damn it, of course it was Bulgaria. Those are the Bulgarian colors. I'm dumb. I'm 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 not having a good round this time. But hey, these happen. I'm trying to get as close as I can to Burden and Brandon. That doesn't help me. This one might. That's a root. The Canadian one. Well, fuck. <laughs> that is a big road, if you're unaware. The one is basically from Vancouver all the way to... Um, does it go to Montreal? So, I mean, it's flat, so it kind of makes it from here to there. It could be any of those locations. It's not the British Columbia, I'm going to say. However, um, here we go. Maybe this will help. Um, we've got Trans Canada or Manitoba. Hey, look at that. That is helpful. That is actually helpful. Uh, I'm going to put us here. I'm going to hit home. And we're going to go back and look at this sign. Because it was what? Brandon and... Burden and Brandon. All right. So now we're looking for a Burden and a Brandon. There's Verndon. So Brandon has to be... we got to be like here then, aren't we? Because Verdon is a hard right. Brandon's a bit of a drift. I think I might have got it. I, or, or, it said it was heading east. So, what's the street? What is the street? Um, is it going to say at the intersection here? I doubt it will. But if I go here, maybe there'll be a sign. No, that's going to say we're heading west. Oh, stupid, you stupid RV. How dare you? Um, maybe we're here. It doesn't feel like this is it. There's no like hard turns, a bit of a merge, so maybe it's like there. I need a sip. It's, a, I think, at least a better guess than my previous one was. I gotta stretch for the last couple of seconds here. My apologies. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, I don't know why. I usually sometimes get up this, uh, like, an hour before my alarm goes off, and it usually does knock me out as much as this one did, but... Oh, shit. We were on the other side. Near Oak Valley Schnauzers, huh? I want to see all the Schnauzers. I don't see any. I am disappointed. Hello, Italy, Portugal, Greece. This says Olive Garden. Isn't it weird that you associate olives and olive oil? You associate olive oil with Italian food, but olives are a Greek thing. I don't know, maybe I just made that dumb observation right now. But that's that's just what I've done. Uh, you get tired loopy, me, and you'll get weird, dumb observations like this one. Church of uh, Panagia Damiotisa. I know exactly where that is. It's in Greece. Now. I don't know anything about Panagia Damiotisa. Damiotisa. I think Hellenistic kind of follows. I think um, you'll have to forgive this tangent, but I think the way it works, at least with a lot of languages, is that there's only one um, syllable in the word that actually has like a 
you say it with like gusto compared to the rest of them. It's like the hard pronunciation syllable. If you think about it, um, say the word about. What's the syllable that you like punch on? You like say the most gusto with it's bout. Uh, it's just kind of the soft things about. And I think Greek is the same way. So instead of saying like damio tisa, see dami and t, those are both like the syllables that you like punch on, I guess you could say. It could just be like damio, damio tisa. My brain isn't working. It could just be one of those is the hard syllable. The rest are just said softly and the way I was pronouncing it, like damio tisa could just be incorrect. And it could be damio tisa where it's like just a different syllable. Hello, flag. I don't know what this says. I don't know if I'm looking at some white nationalist flag here in um, Greece, but I'm assuming that this kind of looks like the flag they have for Albania. So maybe we're in like the region bordering Albania. I'll just say, I don't know what this flag is. I'm going to assume that I'm completely wrong and we're on an island of Naxos. This is Naxos, isn't it? I believe so. Oh shit, that was the end of the daily challenge. That's probably the lowest we've done, at least in a while. But, need a sip? Ah. And, as I mentioned, I'm a little tired. Probably a bit out of it. I'm going to cut this one short. Apologies. Hopefully when the video goes up, or Wednesday, I mean... Friday. I won't be as zonked out. But either way, go enjoy your day. I'm going to try to as well. Just relax. Try not to take naps because naps are bad. They'll throw me all out for the rest of the day. I will see you very shortly. As in terms of days. It'll be Friday. I'll see you then. Goodbye.